I hate narration. I don't know how to read well, but I don't want a bad grade for this assignment. Ha! Ah, maybe I can use text-to-speech software instead. Surely that would sound better than me. Have you ever thought about how many turtles are dead because of plastic each year? Every year, we lost more than 1,000 turtles because of this tragedy. Wait, stop! Do you really think this is a good idea? What else can I do though? My voice is flat. My English is bad. Guess what? I am sad. Trust yourself. I'm sure you can do a way better job than Microsoft Mike. All you need is just some tips and practices. Let's do it together. First of all, before the start of our practice, we need to warm up, just like before doing exercise. The vocal warm-up exercise helps relax our vocal muscles and improves our voice quality. So, do I need to sing Do Re Mi Fa So? Nah, just some simple tongue twisters will do. Try these! Um, she sells seashells by the seashore. She sells seashells by the seashore. How can a click clam cram in a clean cream can? How can a clam cram in a clean cream can? Yes, now our vocal muscles are properly warmed up, let's practice our tone and emotion. Every time when we narrate a line, we need to think about what emotions we want to deliver in that line. Look at your scripts. Every year, we lost more than 1,000 turtles because of this tragedy. Can you say it with various emotions? Every year, we lose more than 1,000 turtles because of this tragedy. Every year, we lose more than 1,000 turtles because of this tragedy. Every year, we lose more than 1,000 turtles due to this tragedy. Good job! Remember to be aware of which emotion to express in your narration. Okay, next. Mm, researchers have found that there was a 1 in 5 chance for the full consumed just one item. Careful! We need to make sure that your audience can understand you. Why don't you slow down and pronounce each word clearly and carefully? Researchers have found that there was a 1 in 5 chance of death for a turtle who consumes just one item. Much better! Now, other than the pronunciation and articulation, we should also pay attention to our word stress and intonation. Try this sentence. I didn't say she stole the painting. Can you do it with different stresses? I didn't say she stole the painting. 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 Oh, that's very interesting. It seems like the meaning changes when I stress on a different word. Okay. Let me try that out. Researchers have found that there was a 1 in 5 chance of death for a turtle who consumes just one item. The word stress is that, but watch out for your intonation. It sounds like you're unsure about the fact because of your rising tone. In a statement, we usually use a falling tone at the end. Oh, okay. Let me try that again. Researchers have found that there was a 1 in 5 chance of death for a turtle who consumes just one item. Great! Okay, last bit. In light of this, countries such as the US, UK, New Zealand, and China have been regulating the use of plastic bags and straws to protect turtles from this serious threat. Can you breathe? Remember to chop the sentence into logical and manageable chunks instead of doing it in one breath. Try again! In light of this, countries such as the US, UK, New Zealand, and China have been regulating the use of plastic bags and straws to protect turtles from this serious threat. That's it! That's our 5 tips for narration. How do you feel now? I feel a lot more confident. Let's go record it! How about you? Do you think you can do better than Microsoft Mike now? Try following our 5 tips and practices and record your own narration today. If you want to get more help, feel free to book a consultation at the speaking studio to get personalized feedback. See you there!